Welcome to Punarvasi Technologies. www.punarvasi.com is my website. I write different articles on SAP basis administration daily tasks in this website. You can read those articles to get benefit out of my articles. In this video, I'll explain you how to configure three system landscape which is recommended by SAP switch to the SAP system. Here is the SAP system. There are four SAP systems available on this particular host means four times the SAP system has been installed for performing different types of SAP basis administration tasks. So in this video, for configuring three system landscape, you need to have three different SAP systems should be installed on different physical hosts. But to record this video, I have installed all three systems in single host. So just you can consider that these three systems are separately installed on three different physical hosts. First system is development system and second one is QAS that is quality assurance system. Third system is production system. In my earlier video, I have explained how to configure two system landscape by using development and production. That means the development and quality assurance will be done in the development system and the production will be done in the production system in the case of two system landscape in the case of three system landscape the development or customizing will be done in the development system and the developments or customizations will be transported to quality assurance system and the quality assurance system the developments or customizations will be tested once they are approved then those changes will be imported into the production system so this will be possible when you configure three system landscape. First, log on to development system and see the configuration details. And the two system configuration will be there. We have to adjust that with three system landscape. Just log on to the SAP system, development system. Go to triple zero client. and uh, type stmst code here and click on the ORU, click on the systems. The TMS is already configured and two systems are already there in the domain that is transport domain. So what are all those that is development system and production system. If you go to environment and click on the transport routes, you can see the graphic also that is development and production and the transport routes. Now, I am going to show you how to change this particular two system landscape into three system landscape. Okay, now just click on the configuration and click on the exit button. First log on to quality assurance system, quality assurance system because the development system production system already entered into the domain. So just the system which is not available in this configuration is QA system just log on to QA system to add the QA system into the existing domain. Enter into the triple zero client. Here type STMS for configuring TMS in QA system. And by default the screen will be displayed here because the configuration files already available in the trans directory. The domain controller information is name that is system system identifier is dev and target host is NW7HP1 system number is 00 user transport user is TMS ADM. This user will be created when you configure TMS. Okay, just click on the save button to accept the defaults so that the system will be added into the existing transport domain. And SAP system waiting to be included in transport domain. 
click on the system overview of development system click on the refresh button here and directly the physical system it has been added here and it is waiting for approval by the domain controller if you remember in the two system landscape what i have did is what i what i have done is i have created virtual system before adding production system into the transport domain in this video what i did i have directly added the qa system without creating virtual system just to uh, explain you either way you can do you can create a virtual system then you can add the physical system or directly if you have the physical system already available you can configure the tms in that physical system so that the physical system will be available for approval in the domain controller system so in this way how i did now just just like that you have to do now the qa system is ready here just click on the qa system and just go to sap system click on the approve button to approve that particular system in the transport domain should configuration change be distributed immediately yes click on the yes button so that the configuration information will be distributed to all the systems so wherever you log on to like uh, whichever system you want to so this table is same like development system production system qa system and in the qa system go to for you click on the systems same table should be displayed here you see and even in the production also for suppose you log on to the production system and check the table triple zero and type stmst code here and go to or you click on the systems same information that is development system production system qa system all systems are active status and release of all the systems are 701 and remember that to configure TMS in three system landscape all the system should have the same release and same patch level then only the transport management system will work perfectly without having any issues and this particular symbol denotes controller that is domain controller by seeing this particular symbol you can identify which system is domain controller means the configuration files are stored at this particular system and the configuration will be distributed to other systems from this system now the systems are ready for configuration of three system landscape now let us configure three system landscape and the configuration only can be done within domain controller but suppose if you are in production if you want to configure this particular three system landscape from the production system it is not possible click on the environment click on the transport routes you don't have the display or change button in the application toolbar have you seen not only in the production even in the quality assurance also so suppose if you click on environment and click on transport routes there is no button available here that is display or change button is not available here and that butler button is only available in the development system go to environment click on the transport routes okay just see the display change button is available here so without this button you can't get this particular option standard configuration three systems in group you can't you can't make it enable so to make that enable just click on the display or change button the configuration editor switch to change mode means whatever the changes you want to do you can do in this mode click on the configuration go to standard configuration three systems in group and you have to specify the which system performs which role development system is dev system and quality assurance system qa system and a production system prd system click on the continue button and once you get this graphic you can make it bigger so that you can clearly view the graphic that is development system development will be done in this system and the developments or customizations will be transported through the different routes that is sap specific objects will be transported to through transported to qa system through this route 
and the customization customization means the changes you want you have done in the customization that is uh, like for example uh, different roles have been created and assigned to the users will be transported to QA system through this particular route and once the quality assurance test has been done in this particular system that will be imported into the production system so this is the process of three system landscape okay and now click on the save button and name this particular landscape as three system landscape click on the transfer button click on s to distribute all the changes to all systems configuration was distributed and activated and just click on the log click on the exit button and uh, same graphic will be displayed in the other systems also if you click on the refresh button here same graphic will be displayed here in the QA system and in the production system also click on the refresh button and click on the maximize button so that same configuration will be there in this production system also so in this way you have to configure three system landscape i hope you understood this experiment perfectly if you have any doubts or questions you can leave your comments at that is www.unarvasi.com or you can leave your comments under this video in my youtube channel that is sapbasis.tv thanks for watching